Roman candles. Diego. Come on, Diego! Salta puto! Get out of the truck! There he is, there he is, get him! there and that is the possum he is not dead he was just in the dog's mouth holy cow that is awesome what's up guys it's dfw junk guys junk removal service check this guy out check this guy out introduce hey. yourself man hey what's up guys i'm montel lewis from junk on the run dfw this is junk on the run dfw and he's coming out to help me oh yeah this is what we got we got a big ass hot tub so it is hot it, it is very hot talk about the sweat <laughs> already. We haven't done we haven't, anything to no this guy. Look yet. at this guy. Look at this guy. <laughs> He's already sweating like crazy. So. 30 degree heat out here yeah, at least. Yeah. So at we, least. Got, we got about an eight man hot tub right now. We're going to knock this out. Uh, so it's going to take us what? About how long do you think? Hopefully about two hours. Two hopefully. Hours. Yeah. And it's going to be how hot, man? <laughs> I see a lot of people don't understand how hot it gets in Texas right. and in Dallas. So I get a lot of people telling me all the time, hey, man, you know, we're, we're able to get out, be out here in 100 degree temperature, but they don't understand the humidity and the temperature in detail. Right, right. And they sneak up on you, you know. So guys, even though he's my competitor, we're still friends. And yeah. we're going to later do a video about how he helped me out when right. I was on vacation in Corpus right. Christi. Actually doing business, Corpus Christi, kind of vacation kind of deal. But we're going to do another video later on today as soon as I get these damn cameras working on because they keep on turning off. Anyway, guys, we're going to start off here. Again, junk on the run, Montel. Capel, Texas, right? Yeah. Based He's out based out of Capel. Capel. I'm based out of Dallas. Okay. We're about how many minutes? Uh, about 30. 30 minutes about away? 30 minutes. Guys, we gotta get going, man, before it just we start melting out here, okay? <laughs> and all I brought was my F550 and a mini dumpster. That's all I had empty, so it's pretty right. fun. We're gonna have we're gonna have fun loading this piece of shit. So <laughs> let's get with it. Alright all guys, right. we'll be back. Take it easy. Visitor. Yeah. Got a possum. Got a possum. He's a big boy. Yeah. He's a big boy. He, he uh she may not seen a second set of eyes. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Get the homeowner. Hey, you wanna come and see this? Possum. Oh yeah. yeah, he's a big boy too. Check him out. Hey buddy! <laughs> so oh he's gonna give a shit too. What's your solution to the bus? We gotta try to get I don't him know who's there. sweating more, me or you. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta try to get him out of there. We gotta get him out of there. So, uh, just to let y'all know, uh, possums have dealt with this before, and possums are really, uh, yeah. you don't mess with them, they won't mess with you. So, what we're gonna do is just. Territorial. Yeah. Well, well, the thing is, they are territorial, but if you don't mess with them, right. they won't mess with you. And uh, we're gonna shake them out of here, I guess. Yeah, try to at least get them out of one way. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> This is the homeowner. <laughs> it's your possum. Why don't you get under there and get him out? Oh, yeah. No. no. <laughs> well, at this point, things hadn't gotten any better. We couldn't get the possum out of here. and We were getting really frustrated. At one point, we were just poking at it and trying to talk it out of there and shaking things up. Well, I'll let Montel try to explain it. All right, guys. Montel, Junker to Run DFW. Cutting this hot tub and we got a little visitor here. We got a possum. Slow down process just a little bit. Then we gotta try to create a way to get him out so we can continue on with the process of getting his hot tub removed. Right now he's stuck behind the walls and he's, you know, he's very comfortable right now. Guys, there you go. All right. Looks like a wire. Is it awesome? Are you ready to see him get out? Next task is get him out, guys. Yeah, we're gonna have to get this guy out. 
This has turned out to be a non-junk removal job. It is now a possum out job. Well, here we go again. I'm just gonna try to up here and separate this thing with my hands. So the possum's right underneath me, and my whole idea is to just, you know, maybe scare him out of here. I didn't want to hurt him, of course, and well, I got a whole crowd of people watching me now. So the husband's back here, the little kid's watching me, and the wife's back here. And they're all watching, being sure I don't injure this animal. So it's pretty funny because Travis was really cool. His son, Gavin, was really interested. He wanted to see everything get out of here, but things got carried away. So look at me. Look how kind of... That's how scared I am. I'm on top of the hot tub. I'm cutting it. So... Ain't I gonna fall down when I finish cutting it, but it didn't happen. Besides the fact, the point is, we just don't wanna hurt the possum. We're trying to get him out, and I don't know where the possum's out, and I'm paranoid that he's gonna come out and just bite me, but look at him. He's just chilling there. I gotta try to poke him out, and we, we, we just can't find anything to do with him. He, every time we push him one way, he goes the other way, and then he just turns around and retracts. But what I'll try to do here is cut this piece right here. I'm gonna grab him with my bare hands. I've done this before plenty of times by the bayou over there in Louisiana, you know Sure, sure, come on. What kind of dog you got? Oh, yeah. Fuck, I'm gonna fuck out of here. <laughs> Alright, we're using a different angle. Uh, Montel, they. Holy shit! Uh -oh. Hold on, man. We gotta introduce we gotta the bull master. We got a guest out here. So the owner, homeowner, said he had a bull master. Right. And he's got a Cujo is what he's got. <laughs> Check out the size of this big old melon. Holy cow. Big old head, look how big it is. Oh my gosh. Where are you going? Uh-oh. So we're gonna use the dog to scare him out. Oh my gosh, he's big. I don't know if you had this horse. Uh, May. He's, a, he's, a, he's, a, he's born in May, last May. Yeah? Yeah, uh, uh, not this, yeah, last year. Last oh, okay. Year. But he's about 14 months. He's a, a Jax. Hey, buddy. Hey, yes. Jax. Hey, Jax. You ain't worried about all the other. Come here. Come here. Look. Hey, Jax. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Hey. Thank you. Let's go. Dude. So when the owner told me he owned a bull mastiff, I was totally surprised. He brings out this dog that was just huge. It looked like a small mini horse, right? And he brings him out, but the problem was he wouldn't do nothing. Look at the owner. He's trying to push him into the back of the hot tub. And you would think this dog would just wants to rip this thing apart, but it didn't come out to be a bull mastiff. He started acting like a little poodle girl. And it was just frustrating because we've been here for over an hour and 30 minutes. But you know what? I didn't expect what was about to happen because uh, the bull mastiff that was a little girl turned out to be a, let's just say, a Cujo, and I'm talking about in a big way. Here, uh, let me show it to you right now. Like Jax, who's a bull mastiff. Yeah, take a look at uh, him. He's like Benji right now. He's not, he's, he's huge as hell. Check him out. His head's yeah. as big as mine. And uh, uh, we have a possum. I almost ran over the owner's wife. And this is what I call instinct, because look at the bull massive now. He sees the possum and it's showtime, guys. Well, if you blinked, you missed it. He actually grabs it. Check it out. It's in his mouth. I couldn't believe it. But here it is in slow motion. Jax is a total stud. Forget the poodle. This is Cujo in action. God, Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! God, Jesus! Jesus! What the hell? I did not. Jack, put him down, Jack. Jesus, Jack, put him down. Put him down, Jack. Oh my God. <laughs> this is not. What did I expect? The dog has grabbed. The dog grabbed the, the pasta. Oh yeah. Oh. Holy cow! Oh, let him go. Uh, okay, Jack, come here. Come here, leave it alone, leave it alone. Leave it alone. Oh my god, he did it <laughs> so did. fast, yeah. it was incredible. I thought he was gonna get caught up. So the duck, the, 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 no, no, he didn't kill it. So the possum is playing possum at the moment. And that's what they're good at. So let me show you what's going on right now, guys. <laughs> oh, he's got his tongue out and everything. Yeah, I got the whole thing, dude. And the possum is acting possum right now. 
No, but he's really smart. I mean, he's yeah. smart. All right. Come on, Montel. Come on over. Come on over, Montel. <laughs> look at him. Look at him. He's, 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 so, <laughs> he's such a good actor. Yeah. You can see him. All right, Montel, get over here so you can see him. Give him space in the middle. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> so keep an eye on him. <laughs> so, Jax, Jax, who was acting like a poodle. <laughs> Let me tell you what happened. Jax was acting like a poodle. This big old bull mastiff came in here. And I swear, he, he sneaked in there. It took less than yeah. half a second, but he turned from a poodle to Cujo <laughs> at a snap of a finger. <laughs> this dude's a beast. <laughs> but look, here's what's really funny is the possum is actually still alive. And he act possum in front of Jack's, in, in Ma Jack's mouth. Yeah, yeah. And, and the, the bull mastiff just let him go. I'm going to tell you, I want to buy a bull mastiff now. <laughs> I think yeah, everybody so should. God. <laughs> he was oh, so man. fast. But there he is. Check that out. We'll Jesus Christ! God, Jesus! Jesus! This is what the hell! I did not. Jax, put him down, Jax! Jesus! Jax, put him down! Put him down, Jax! Oh my gosh! This is not what I expected. The dog has grabbed the the dog grabbed the, the possum. Put him in there. Oh yeah. Um. Holy cow! Oh, uh -oh. Okay. Right close to his mouth. <laughs> okay. Right there, and that is the possum. He is not dead. He was just in the dog's mouth. Holy cow! That is awesome. Boss man, what'd you think, man? Come on over. Come on, come on over. Come on over, man. <laughs> we got to see. You. So, uh, talk about your poodle that turned into Cujo. <laughs> I, I, he just, I don't know, he just went in there and snatched him, it was like, you know, when they carry him around the crowd. He just ran over your wife, too. <laughs> Get out of here, he's, he's gonna get it. Yeah, <laughs> that was awesome. All right, guys, I don't know about the hot tub uh, anymore, <laughs> but Jax, who's uh, just a, he's a beast, I ain't gonna lie to you. He went in there like military style, he grabbed the possum, and he came out with the possum. That was awesome. Anyway, guys, let's finish off this hot tub. Let's get, get, out. Let's get it done. So if you didn't think things could get any weirder or funnier, check this out. We started cutting and yeah, those are baby possums. Exactly 10 of them. Total 11, counting the mother. So I didn't know what to do and I didn't want to kill them of course. So my thing was let's just round them up and let's get a hold of them without harming any of them at least. I never really held a uh, possum but I figured they couldn't bite because they were little. So. We decided to pick them up, and here's me, like an idiot with gloves, and I get scared and I drop him because I think he's gonna bite me, and I, I didn't know what to do. I mean, this is the first time I ever holding Jesus. a possum, to be honest. With you. Look, I just drop him. Eh, he landed on him of course, so it doesn't matter. Then I just, you know, I'm gonna look for a bucket. Is my thing. And everybody was so helpful. I mean, that, you know, the, the owner Travis and his son, they decided to help out. And, Gavin, his son, went and got a bucket, and we decided to put them all in a bucket and round up as many as we can, and hopefully the mother will come back and get them. Uh, this day had come out to a big one. Look, he wanted to bite me. So, they were kind of really calm, not really nervous animals, and I was kind of scared to hold them, but I did it anyway. Look at me, put them in front of the GoPro that's not even on. But, let's get on with the show. Here we go, guys. So, if you got a pail, let's put them in a pail for the mama. Once you get those out, you got your gloves on. I'll round up these right here. But the show's not over, guys, because I'm grabbing for all the possums I can find, and I find this one, and I realize, wait a minute, um, is this a possum? It's kind of moving a little fast. It wasn't. It was an actual rat. Yeah, it was a rat that I grabbed. Oh, that Jesus Christ! Well, anyway, 
Oh, this rent. day was just getting worse and worse and worse. It was an adventure. We had fun doing it, but uh, we did gather all of it's them. It's okay, it's okay. So, Jeez, here's chill, the rest chill, of the show. Chill, chill, chill. Enjoy it, guys. Ugh, mother... He's going your way. Oh, he's going towards the house. Look at this guy. Check him out. Hey man, I was, I was, I was uh, chasing down the the possum, grabbing it, and it was moving too fast when I had its tail. It was that rat. I grabbed the rat's tail. The rat was fast. Yeah, he was. Yeah. Holy shit! He's one. He's right there. What? He's there's a baby one. Another? Yeah, I didn't see him. I splashed him with this stuff. Coming out this way. Yeah, here he goes. There you go. Grab him, grab him, grab him. You got him? Yeah, I got him. Okay. Where's the little pack? Ga Gavin. Might have to wash him down, man. Is that hot or cold? It's, it's cold. It's cold? Yeah. I don't know what to do. Okay. Maybe so. Maybe that get him. Yeah, that get him. Gavin. How many you got, Gavin? Five now. All right, Gavin. So what's what's going on, man? What what your dad have back here? Because so far we've got what three animals so far? Yeah. We got a little mousy mouse, and then we, what do you have in your hands? Um, baby, baby possums. Five of them. Oh man. <laughs> We came, we came here to remove a hot tub. What's up guys, it's Ricardo, DFW Junk. I just finished up the hot tub. Oop. Right, Montel, Junk on the Run, DFW. And then the homeowner. Travis Scott. The homeowner. Or is it the possum <laughs> owner? <laughs> so, we don't know if we had a, a hot tub to remove, a mouse to remove, or a possum. But you're not, let's, not talk, let's talk about the possums. How many possums were there actually? Ten. Ten possums and you didn't know that? I had no idea. You, you beat the record. I mean, you beat. Definitely, you do have the record for the most possums. Now, I have had this problem before where there's possums on the hot tub, in the hot tub, but um, you had 10 possums. Yes, underneath. <laughs> we, we are now a junk removal and possum removal. removal yeah. pet possum removal. Yeah. There you go. Uh, what did you think for our service today? Awesome. Loved it. It was a blast, actually. <laughs> It was awesome a surprise. Too. So talk about your Mastiff. You brought him out here, he was acting like a little baby, and then... Jax, my bull Mastiff, he came out, he was scared. The very big, scared. Very scared. And then all of a sudden he sees the possum, and he's like, oh, okay. So he just creeps for it, and all of a sudden just snatches it, and then just takes off with it in his mouth. And I hit the pole twice. <laughs> that same pole, I hit it twice. Uh, what did you think about the, your first experience here with me working on a hot tub? On a hot tub, uh, On a hot tub, it was a lot of work, but uh, eventually we got it done. Uh, Venture. Yeah, it was. <laughs> yeah. Uh, would you recommend this to other customers? I mean, other. Definitely. You know. Oh yes, definitely. Uh, good, good reviews online. But definitely. Awesome. And you saw my other videos, didn't you? I watched the one. I watched one yesterday. You know, uh, taking it apart. Taking it apart. Huh. Where we go? We got a viewer. Uh, anyway, I always ask my customers only, only if we did a good job removing possums to give us two thumbs up. Yes. Awesome there it is, guys. There it is. Awesome removal. <laughs> guys, that's the last video I'm going to do today. It is so hot. I don't even want to film it. The only reason I'm filming today is because we're under this. Yeah. yeah. But <laughs> if it's too hot, I'm not going to film. So that's going to do it for us. Don't forget to check out our videos over there to the right, right. side. Mm -hmm. And on the left side, don't forget Here. to just subscribe. So you jump yeah. in and say subscribe, right? Okay. So don't forget, guys, uh, check out my other videos over there on the right side. <laughs> <laughs> so don't forget guys, check out my other videos on the right side. And if you like the videos, don't forget to left side. <laughs> to subscribe. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye bye guys. Okay.